These exclusive pictures were filmed at a secret Al Fatah training camp in Jordan. A Pathy News cameraman was taken there by an officer of the guerrilla force to see the sort of training volunteers are subjected to. The camp is not many miles from the Israeli border, a border which men like these feel dedicated to erase. They train hard and purposefully in their belief that one day they will liberate the land which now separates them from the Mediterranean, the Holy Land, Israel. Since 1948, when the State of Israel was declared, thousands of Arabs have left the country as refugees. Many swore to return one day to what they consider their homeland. And since the Six-Day War in June 1967, Arab feeling has become even more inflamed. Until that time, Jerusalem had been a divided city. The Israelis captured it all, at the same time pushing their borders outwards in other directions too. Hundreds of thousands of Arabs became homeless refugees. The fire to return to their captured lands had reached flashpoint. al Fatah was born to liberate Palestine. Its members are commandos, ruthless, fearless, dedicated. al Fatah training is under battle conditions. The ammunition is live. Just how many recruits have been killed or wounded during this type of training is not known. But there have been casualties. When the fight is for life, death is never far away. Al-Fatah, though a guerrilla force, is nevertheless an army. It has doctors, nurses, medical supplies, hospitals, and patients. They have to be nursed and healed, ready to fight another day. A high-ranking strategy conference is taking place in this tent. Their faces remain hidden. These men are the spearhead of the Al-Fatah movement. Bloodshed and suffering on both sides goes on, while a peaceful solution is sought in other quarters.